if you want to clone apps on Google Pixel 10 Pro, what you can do is you can use the private space. Unfortunately, there is no dedicated option that allows you to duplicate apps on Google Pixel 10 Pro and private space can actually be used for that because private space is like a separate environment that contains different apps, data, accounts, and so on and so forth. And we can also install apps separately. So in order to set it up, we just have to open settings. Now we're going to go to uh, security and privacy over here and then choose private space. We need to verify ourselves with the screen lock password or biometrics. And we're going to go ahead and press setup in the bottom right corner. We just need to wait a couple of seconds to set up the private space. And then we will have to sign into a Google account, which is used, for example, to, let's say, access the Play Store. So let's press got it. And I'm going to sign into my account. And if you want to, you can use a completely different Google account than the one that you use on your phone right now. In my case, I'm just going to use the same one. Afterwards, I will select that I will be using this device. Let's go next. We need to agree to Google Terms of Service, and then we can set up the password. Now, you can either create a new lock for the private space, or you can use the same password as you use for the screen lock. And I'm going to actually use the same as I do for the screen lock. I just care about cloning apps. I don't care about some additional uh, privacy or something. And let's press done. Now, the private space can be found at the bottom of the app drawer. In order to unlock it, we need to tap on this uh, lock over here. There we go. And now we have our private space. Now, in order to clone the app, let's say I want to clone Spotify. I already have Spotify over here. Let's say that I have an account set up. I can clone the Spotify by just pressing install over here. I will open the Play Store in the private space. And if I try to install the same app, I still will be able to do so, even though I already have the app. So it will look like this. Let's see if it's going to work. There we go. So we can easily install the app over here. And if I go to the app drawer and open the private space, as you can see here, we have Spotify. And this app over here doesn't have any data because it is like a freshly, like a newly installed app. So no data over here. I can sign into any account that I want to. I can use the same account as I use over here or a completely different one if I want to, of course. And this is how we can clone apps. So unfortunately, this can be a little bit inconvenient to use because every time you try to access the duplicated app, you have to open the private space like this. Uh, but uh, this is one of uh, the ways that allow you to uh, duplicate apps on your Google Pixel 10 Pro. And I believe this is the only way to clone apps without having to install a third party app. And that's pretty much it. Thanks for watching. Leave a like and subscribe.